at Zero Day Brewing in Harrisburg. We test the pH of our water every day. Every we week there is always some beer in the boiler. We're adding different amounts of brewer salts than what we normally do. But never a brew quite like this batch. I don't think anything like this has been done before. And it's not just them. Across the country on the same day, brewers are at work all following the same recipe. A different spin on a collaboration, you know? The breweries are answering a call to action from Sierra Nevada, a brewing company in Northern California, which was ground zero for the recent wildfires. It was like two miles away from the Chico Brewery, but 10% of their workforce was affected. That brewery asked hundreds of others to make the same IPA, a new brew called Resilience. It's such a simple recipe. It even provided the ingredients. In turn, all proceeds from Resilience IPA, no matter where it's sold, will go to the wildfire relief efforts. When they reach out and ask for help, it's, it's kind of a natural thing to say yes for us. Zero Day is brewing enough of the IPA to fill 10 kegs, which could last a few weeks, depending on its customers' thirst and philanthropy. I think this big overall story, um, it's going to be well received. The Benefit beer is expected to hit taps by mid-December. I think it's a really neat um, way to show how beer can really just bring people together and you really can, you know, change the world with a beer. <laughs> Should be good. In Harrisburg, Matt Barcaro, WGAL News 8. Dozens of Susquehanna Valley breweries have joined in to make this special beer, and Matt put a link to the full list of participating breweries on his Facebook page.